that I'll look at multiplying polynomials. So here's our first example. We have 2x squared times 5xy cubed. Okay, the rules are you multiply the coefficients. So I'm going to multiply 5 and 2 together to get 10. Then I'm going to take my x squared and my x over here, and I'm going to go ahead and write in the first power because anytime you have a variable without a degree, it is to the first power. We're going to take those exponents and we're going to add them together. So that's really just saying 2 plus 1. And then I'm going to bring over my y cubed because I don't have a y in both terms. So now let's just add those exponents together and simplify this. So I've got 10 times y cubed or x cubed, y cubed. And that is how you multiply polynomials together. Let's look at a second, a second example. So I've got 25 x squared y cubed times 2 x y to the fourth, z squared. Okay, again, I'm going to use my rules. I multiply my coefficients together, so I'm going to get 50. x squared and x to the first power. That's x squared and x to the first. So I'm going to add my exponents to x cubed. y cubed times y to the fourth. So y cubed and y to the fourth, I again add those exponents. That's going to add to y to the seventh. And then this one only has a z on one term, so I'm just going to bring that over as z squared. So let's bring that down and bring down my coefficient. So my answer is 50 x cubed y to the seventh z squared, and that's my final answer. Hope this video was helpful.